She's 15 years old and wants to be an engineer. Now, there's nothing wrong with dreaming or even planning for your future, but News Channel 5's John Favoli has the story of a South Florida teen who is already well on her way to achieving her goal. And we went to tour Google. 15 year old Hannah Herbst seems like any other girl her age. That is, until she starts talking about her invention. And as the kinetic movement of the current energy as a result of tidal flux in the Boca Raton Inlet moves my pencil wheel system, it turns an AC generator. She's talking about a prototype of an ocean energy probe that could one day provide electricity to countries that don't have access to power. And then that power is transmitted through a bridge rectifier, which converts it into DC power. And then can light up my light system. Did you get all that? What's important to know is that Hannah, a ninth grader at Florida Atlantic University High School, developed this prototype with help from a 3M scientist. I call it Beacon, which stands for bringing electricity access to countries through ocean energy. Her invention won her the 2015 Discovery Education 3M Young Scientist Challenge and earned her the title of America's Top Young Scientist. I was inspired by my 10 year old pen pal Ruth, who lives in Ethiopia. And she's living without access to electricity and energy poverty. So I wanted to do something to help her, and that's my overall goal is to deploy it to them. Hannah is sharing part of her $25,000 cash prize with her pen pal and others. Well, I recently donated $1,000 to her family, $1,000 to another family, and $1,000 to the Compassion International Christmas Program, which was amazing to be able to do. That was the cap they would let me donate. So. It felt really great to be able to help her in that way. This enterprising young lady will be attending college at FAU next year, where she plans to study engineering. Just a regular 15-year-old with big aspirations and the smarts to make it happen. Good luck, Hannah. John Favoli, WPTV News Channel 5.